Daniel. The crying had stopped and he could hear a whisper coming from the cell. They were up to something, and he would have to punish them. Daniel, I didn't care for you when I found out that you had just been murdering prisoners. In fact, torturing prisoners. Now, you're a fucking child murderer. You deserve to die horribly. In fact, come on, let me go back to that, uh, back to that shadow chasing you. You lucky twat. A slight headache. You should have more than a slight headache, you murdering bitch. Says I could not care about you anymore. What's down here? Nothing. Fair enough. I suddenly can't run. Is the guilt finally setting in? Good. No. Oh. Just slam the door in my own face. But you deserve that. Oh. Slight headache. Why the hell's my vision all crap then? I wasn't there before. Right, so it would appear that uh, the Xenomorph's not delivers gifts of... Ow! Okay, fair enough. I won't go that way then. Gifts of Tinder. And I can't go that way. Um, That would have been the door that was blocked last time. Oh, shut up, go away. Stop it. I saw something shining under here. Ow! Fuck's sake. Um, no. If there was something shining under there, I don't care. Ow! How the hell are you supposed to get across this? Seriously. A few cuts and bruises. <laughs> I don't care anymore. Uh, so I can jump. Yoik! Yes, well done, you can jump onto it. Nice one. <sighs> I start to make that potion, don't I? Oh. It's knocked all my torches out. Why is your vision so... shite? Slight headache. You should not have problems seeing when you just got a slight headache. Bloody hell. Ow. Wood is bleeding quite badly. Good! Laboratory. So, okay, this place is open, so I assume I can create that, that potion. Um, idea how. Okay, that breathing is starting to piss me off. You don't deserve it. I'd like to get to the end of this game. With or without your help. 
Uh, Tinder. Oh, hold me. It's wasting oil now. Uh, so I've got shit loads. Um. Can I boil the blood? No. Oh, apparently I can. An incomplete tonic. The tonic is not yet uh, done according to Wire's instructions. Via's instructions. Um. What goes in this this box? Poison? Heat in the gland will not extract the poison. Um. Oh, I get it. When we talk, the mucus evaporates along there, condenses into the bottle, which I'm just about to put there. Still incomplete tonic, so I assume I'm supposed to use this to mash up the uh, the poison. Okay. Picky sod. Okay, poison gland. If you don't mind, stuff that in there and. Make it your mind. Uh, let, go, let go of it. Uh, lefty loosey, righty tighty. Oh, there we go. Picked up Vias Tonic. Right, um, right down here is where Agrippa should be. Dad, I thought I'd lost you. The castle crumbled and I could hear the chancel collapse. The laboratory might be accessible now. So, what am I supposed to do? Thank goodness. Now, pay attention. First, feed me the tonic, and then use the saw to remove my head. As the tonic begins to evaporate, you'll be able to cut off my head without taking my life. Then, take my head and bring it with you. As you enter the gate, Alexander is opening into the inner sanctum. What do you mean? Why wouldn't you enter the gate? Because I thank you now. You need to act. Yeah, you can uh, sit there and rob. I was a player and dared to proceed that I did not. I don't care. He unearthed a number of tavern temples and gathered a whole collection of orbs. But unlike every other finder since the fall of the Israel, he was able to unshackle the heart you and I connected. Well, shut up. Um there seems to be anything glowing on there, so I assume there's nothing worth risking my ass for. Oh, goody. I found a bone saw. Trail of blood to this door. That won't budge, thank God for that. Okay, feed him the tonic. Cut his head. That's a real I've done all that I can to escape this place. Ow. But now, I use all my strength merely to stay alive. That's nice. Quickly, off the 
<laughs> a surgeon's saw, used for amputation. <laughs> Not decapitation. Oh, shut up. Oh, I really should have let him finish the sentence so I knew what to do with the head. The severed head of Agrippa, which I just happily stuffed into my pocket. Yeah, um, yeah I never gave him a chance to tell me what I'm supposed to do with this head. Oh well, I'm sure it come to me. I did get a journal actually though. An orb is needed to enter the inner sanctum. Its shattered pieces lie scattered in the torture rooms. Well, yeah, I already knew that. Notes. Don't care. Oh, I missed one. Oh. Uh, back. Diaries? No. So that note was just reiterating what I already knew. Can't use your meat grinder to, to talk to me now, can you? Can't turn it off. Oh well. So, oh, that's blocked. That's blocked as well, so, this way. I know, go away. The sight of her lifeless body crippled his psyche. He tried to remove himself from the scene, but he could not. Instead, he fell to his knees and begged her for forgiveness. And so you should! <laughs> 